And, um, <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to... I thought I'd show you some clips from my own TV show back home, you see, because I'm a bit of a legend in my own brunch time back home, as you know. <laughs> and, and so I'm going to show you my, my, some clips from my show, just because apparently people don't think my show is real. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> It is very fine regional local television, I tell ya. It makes TV South look like Merchant Ivory, I tell ya. <laughs> all right, so, uh, so, and that's the thing. So please, what I'm saying is we're going to show you all the clips in one little bunch, then we're going to get on with the show. And just feel free to react as freely and as naturally as you possibly can. And Amy will be moving among you with a cattle prod. Just a hell of a lot. All right. So let, are we ready to roll them, right? So, we, so let's, let's roll the, the, the Good Morning Wool and Bar BT clips, and I'll see you in a minute. Yeah. <laughs> Good, Good morning, morning Wool and Bar. I'm Bob Dow. I'm Judy Frey. Bringing you a song, a chat, and a lot of hair care products. <laughs> you can arrange plastic flowers with real leaves. Oh, it's a fabulous effect, isn't it? But first, <laughs> don't throw out those worn out old sheepskin boots. As if we would. Cut them up into small pieces and use them as powder puffs. <laughs> Joining me now on Good Morning Moolamba, lovely Kimberly Davies, better known as Annalise from Neighbours. Now, Kimberly, you've always got something interesting to show us, but I'm just wondering where today's little product demonstration's going to take me. Well, Bob, we all love that smooth summer look, don't we? And this product really is fabulous mm. because what it does is removes the hair from the root. <laughs> so, uh, Kimberly, is um, <clears throat> is Neighbours still on in the UK? How's how's your British career going? It's great, thanks, Bob. Um, now, with the hair removal <laughs> system. Unlike electrolysis and those other hot, messy waxes, oh, mm. this actually doesn't hurt. <laughs> Putting us through our paces now on Good, good Morning Mall and Bar. The green got it. Take it away, Diana Moran. <laughs> Although that one's, we're going to spill our tea with that one, Diana. <laughs> okay. Now get your heels I, down. Oh, heels oh, ditch. down. I've got a ditch. <laughs> I've got a ditch. <laughs> I'm, I'm all right now, though. I'm okay. Oh, right. oh. Give it some worry. Come on, give it some worry. Stop down. And the other side. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, from the top. One. Oh. From the top. Good. Oh, no, I'm and sorry. Come on. It. You keep and going, Diana. You're one, doing a fabulous two, job. Two, God, she works hard, doesn't she, Judy? It's time for today's book review, and girls, it's romantic fiction. Dame Barbara Cartland. Oh, you know, Bob, it's incredible when you consider that Dame Barbara Cartland is up to a 576th novel. Gosh, that's so prolific. One a year. <laughs> Showing us her fit face exercises, the green goddess, Diana Moran. Well, first two for the jaw for the double chin, the goldfish and the lion. Mm. Uh, goldfish, mm. lion. Goldfish, <laughs> lion. <laughs> lovely, lovely. And now two for the eyes. Flutter, flutter, and then up, side, down, and around. <laughs> flutter, flutter, up, side, down. Diana, <laughs> stuck. <laughs> oh, don't know why, I've got to drive home. Flutter, flutter. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, Moolamba. One of my favourite parts of the week now because I'm joined by a dear friend who's popped down the corridor from the studios of Sunshine Radio where he's on a working holiday. Mr Tony Blackburn. Good morning, Tony. Oh, good morning, Bob, and good morning, my Moolamba. So how's the drive time shift going? Well, the drive time shift's going really well because, as you know here, uh, the drive time lasts from 5 o'clock till about 7 minutes past. Well, that's just time enough, really, for three Richard Pavement records. <laughs> well, the best thing you can't think of. <laughs> hey, have a badge. Oh. It says it all. Thanks. We're pretty excited, and I'll tell you why. Because at the stroke of midnight on Saturday, we are relaunching a Sounds Familiar 699, bringing you the best of the 60s, 70s, 80s, and the 90s Sounds Familiar. <laughs> where we pay you to listen. Tony, <laughs> do you radio people talk like that all the time? Uh, like what, Bob? Like that. Like that. You sort of get home and say, hi, darling, I'm home. How was your day? How are the kids? Bit of traffic on the M1. 
what's unusual about that? Oh, well, nothing. 